Okay, so the first theme uh, or linkage that uh, we want to talk about is the perspective of children and trauma. And this is something that is an emerging topic throughout all these readings that we've been um, looking at since the start of the course. And this theme stands out to me because uh, we're moving beyond the idea of silent witness, that, that quote in the Holt uh, and Company article, um, and moving to a child's eye view. Uh, so I think the idea that's presented in these articles is that there's a lot of value in excavating the children's experience qualitatively that's mentioned in the Stern article. So that idea that we can peel back the layers and, and try to see through the child's eyes what's going on and we can pull um, so much out of that. So we can do that through interviews or pictures or storytelling or, um, you know, retrospectively through auto ethnography um, or by changing the way that we do research. And more on that later. Um, I put figure 3.1 up here. Um, as a way to, you know, hopefully provoke some discussion uh, about the child's perspective, and I think this picture and story do a great, a great job of that. Um, you know, Fletcher, uh, the child in this situation, you know, he's expressing, you know, a lot of interesting things, like uh, he's cataloging the content of the fight, and you know, to me that illuminates the experience for him. Um, and brings to light maybe potential intervention points and focuses. So, uh, you know, what do you think? What interventions interventions could be done for Fletcher? Maybe it's around the attachment to the mother and this need to, you know, catalog the fights so that he can protect her uh, later. And by being a protector, is he putting himself at more risk for violence by doing this? You know, maybe another intervention is around sleep deprivation. You know, he's not getting any sleep. Um, uh, you know, and maybe by getting the children's perspective, we can give, you know, in, in Fletcher's situation, we, we could give the caregiver or the mother some tools to use to help um, build his resiliency, you know, maybe using ARC. Uh, 